What's going on you guys, this is a MaxKDI, I have another video, this is for the Dell Optiplex 790 mini tower, I'm going to be upgrading the um, power supply to Antec 450 watt, and I'll show you guys how to do that, so let me go ahead and uh, remove the side cover panel, now you need a Phillips screwdriver, now you're gonna, there will be four screws here in the back, you get that removed. And if you you guys can watch my other video I did uh, for the for the memory upgrade video card and the hard drive I did a separate video how to do that. Okay, so we're gonna remove the four screws in the back. And if you guys are gonna be using it for gaming, then uh, just depends what kind of kind of video card you have because this power supply has has only one six pin connection right here. And this is only, it's only good for some video cards, but not all of them, because some video cards require 8-pin and a 6-pin, but this only only has power supply, only have 6-pin, 1 connection. So it's going to be good for like a GTX uh, 950, pretty good, uh, GTX 750 work fine, but any like a, like a 7, GTX 760 I know, those require 8-pin and a 6-pin, so the power supply, you have to get a bigger power supply, at least like a 650 watt. Okay, so we're going to remove the power supply. Let me move this video closer here, closer like this, and I'll show you guys. There's a pin right here on the, the top. You gotta press it down to release the lock. First, you're gonna remove the four pin right here connection and the 24 pin. If there's a clip right here, secure clip in the middle. Click on that, and I'll remove it right here. That's in the middle, secure lock. Just press it down over gently and removes it. And move the cable for the power for the hard drive and the optical drive. Just like that. There's a secure lock right here. Press it down with the screwdriver to release the power supply. So this power supply is only it's a 265 watt maximum. Okay, so we're gonna upgrade to 450 watt NTAC. Yeah, the old power supplies are not the same. It just depends what kind of brand you get. Cause some are like considered like they, some like, I would I would say Cooler Master Antec pretty good, Cool Corsair pretty good power supply. My favorite is a Seasonic. Okay, so we're gonna reinstall the power supply and you're gonna screw back the screws in the back, four of them. And uh, now we're gonna connect a four pin. and the 24 pin. Okay, now connect the optical drive. Now you're gonna do the six pin connector, you're gonna connect the hard drive. So yeah guys, it's gonna be it. And what I'll do is I'll I'll show you guys how to update the optical drive. Just do wire, I'll do wire management later. Just realign the, get the cables, uh, do use wire ties on it. So make it all tight. And I'm gonna do the front cover, remove the front cover bezel to get the optical drive if you're gonna upgrade or remove. So there's right here, the clips right here. Gently press it up and removes the front bezel cover. Now, okay, here's the optical drive right here. There's a little clip right here that holds the optical drive. You press it down and remove the SATA cable, power cable to it, remove it. And put another one, where's the other optical drive? Here's another one. Here's another one. And if you have another optical drive, and there's gonna be screws on it, uh, on the front bezel cover, I'll show it to you right here. There's three uh, screws still for another bezel cover. If you're gonna install another optical drive here, there's uh, spare ones in the bezel cover. It's in the, uh, another cover, it's in the back side. You can see there are three screws extra. 
So you're just gonna install another optical drive, slide in, and just reconnect the cables. The SATA and the power. So you guys, this is gonna be it. And uh, so what you're gonna do is uh, reinstall the front cover bezel. That's how easy it is. That's what's nice about Dells. So yeah guys, uh, this is uh, for video for the upgrade the power supply. This is for the 450 watt and then we upgraded, the, we changed the optical drive right there. See so you guys, it's gonna be it. Uh, this is MXKDI, thanks for watching, bye.